the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello. Gamer Nom is back. Wait, 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 Gamer Nom, is that a new avatar? No guys, did Mudo made me this avatar just for special occasions. Are we having a special occasion, Gamer Nom? Yes! We will be having three events in Anime Fighting Simulator. Are you sure? Yes, I am sure. If you're part of the Discord group that the moderators or developers posted this, we are going to be hosting a series of events in the upcoming weeks and months. Prizes will be only AFS related. AFS related, maybe it's Chikara shards, boosts, etc. Maybe special champions. I don't, I'm not sure of that. Exclusive skins, animations. I don't know, guys. Or maybe Robux. I really don't know. Oh, game passes. I'm not sure, guys. But what I'm sure is we will be having an event. Gamer Nom, when will it start? It will start on May 27. That is, including this day, eight days from now better be ready again it is an art event again eight days from now art event so when that came out the first thing that came to my mind is the best avatar cosplay maybe or a uh, fan art right so let me take this opportunity to thank this guys fred fox place share thank you for making a fan art again guys this might happen fun art and uh beach theme shout out to caroline thank you so there you go either cosplay or drawing comment it on the comment section if you have any idea shout out to darken so that's the first event next stop on june 17 we will be having a building event so that's like one month from now building event so you will be using roblox studio or blender i have no idea about that so maybe it will look like this shout out to zenkun but i think this is from minecraft right shout out to zenkun thank you or how about this the best afs uh, GIF or whatever. I really have no idea guys. Co help me with this. Builder event. So comment it on the comment section. Shout out to Isaac for that. For the last event, it is still undecided. But don't worry, the date is already set. July 8th. I will be updating you with that. So next stop, let's talk about the new codes. So we have three new codes. Shout out to 3F Cyphol for commenting it to me. I'm not aware of this. Of we have 49,000 Chikara shards, right? So again, I will be showing you those three codes. I think this is almost 49. This will be giving you almost 10k shards. Yeah, they get Chikara shards, okay? For the first code, we have Duax in stream. Go. Oh, valid, but I saw success first. Hmm. Let's type it again. I hope the either uh, success will appear or use. Right, wax in the stream again. Used, okay. Let's check it if it worked. We have like 48 a while ago, right? Okay, 51. 3k or 2k Chikara shards? I'm not aware. I'll use it wisely. Next up, we have Emperor Star, right? Okay, Emperor Star. I think this is 5k Chikara shards. 8k or 7k so far, not bad. So, last one. Last code we have Frango. I'm sure this is new. Frango new code. See that? New code. Okay, so success for a total of I think nine or ten. I'm not sure. Next up, last part of the video. Someone commented this on my fastest way to get Chikara shards, the 195 rule. Shout out to Pirate Gamer VJM for asking this question. Gamer Gnome, I got more shards when I use the 195 rule on all tiers 1 to 5. Why is it better to only use the rule? A 1 and 5 rule on tier 5. That's my strategy. I don't use it on all tiers. I'm gonna explain to you why. But before that, what is 1 and 5 rule? As every time you finish the boss, the time left should be less or lower than 1 and 5 to get the maximum shards. Okay, so I'm gonna show to you why I am not using that on tiers 1 to 4. Again, how to confirm that I was able to do it properly? The time left after defeating the boss should be more than 1 and 5. You ever know why you're doing it again? Guys, I'll explain to you after. See that? Time left 203 seconds, 180 Chikara shards. That's not the highest Chikara shards that you will get in tier 1. Again, I'll explain to you later why I'm doing that. Tier 2. Finish this fast. There we go. 
Again, the time should be, time left should be more than 195. Time left 199. We are getting, yes, I agree, less Chikara shards here, but there's a reason why I'm doing that. Tier 3. Hundred two seconds left. Tier four. <coughs> Excuse me. As you can see, guys, uh, we're done with tier four. Almost done, and we just uh, spent like one minute and fifteen seconds for this one. Uh, there you go. See that? Two hundred two seconds left. Now we are in tier five again. We need to have a time time left that is less than 195 to activate the 195 rule right so let's do that let's wait for the time as you can see on top of the banner let's wait for it wait for it okay let's check it out we still have 197 okay we can start defeating the boss now <clears throat> So after this, you will see the maximum reward for tier 5 boss. Don't worry, I will show you a compiled form. Again, time left should be less than 195. Time left 181. Okay, we got 2,000 Chikar Shards, 2 point, uh, 2,520. So for a total of 3,676 3, Shards in 2 minutes, tiers 1 to 5, again, I only used the 195 rule in tier 5. Two minutes, we were able to get 3,676 shards. Now we're going to do the technique of uh, Pirate Gamer. This is two times speed, guys, because this, this will be kind of uh, long if we don't do that. But don't worry, the speed is times two, the timer is times two. Again, we're not killing the boss that fast. We need to do the 195 rule. So you can see, guys, 360 Chikara shards. That's a lot compared to what we did on the previous rounds we only got 180 so yeah it shows that if you do the 195 build you will get more shards but again gamer now why are you doing that hmm. i'll explain it to you later after this now we get 496 see that that's more compared again to the last sets that we did <clears throat> okay now this is tier three three Done. 600 that's a lot I think tier 4 will give you 900 and tier 5 will be the same as our last set because we used the 195 rule with that so again we are already past the time on our previous set see that but we're on tier 5 now I think we will be Finishing this in 3 minutes, right? If we round off for the first set, 2 minutes. <clears throat> Excuse me. First set, 2 minutes. Second set, 3 minutes. So we got 4,952 shards in 2 minutes and 55 seconds. That's more compared to our first set, right? The first set only got 3,000 plus. Okay? So now here is the explanation. If I use my strategy, in 6 minutes, I will finish 3 rounds, meaning 15 tiers. So that will give me 11,000 Chikara Shards in 6 minutes. If I finish all tier 1 to 5 with 195 rule, I will only finish 2 rounds. 10 tiers, which will give me 9,904 Shards. Okay, so I hope that's clear. So my strategy is more efficient, faster, easier. So I hope that this answers this. Okay, Pirate Gamer. Okay, so that will be it for this video. I will be posting, posting Mobile Legends video tomorrow or tonight, okay? Again, that will be it. To all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. See you on this upcoming events. This is GamerNom. GamerNom out.